Hey there, Caitlin here, Snap and Nutrition Educator in Waldo County, Maine. Today I've got a quick one for you. We're doing quickles, quick pickles. These are just awesome veggies that you can throw in your fridge. Any firm, crisp veggie, any acid, something sweet, and then herbs and spices. So this is an amazing uh, canvas for you to be creative. And that's how you make quickles. Are you ready? Let's jump in. So I'm making the basic pickles today, the traditional pickles that we think of with cucumbers. So I'm just going to start by peeling them. Um, I like to peel them because it gives an even texture overall when they're done. Um, when you leave the peel on, sometimes the peel is a lot more crispy than the inside, um, but it's totally up to you. I think it also lets a little more flavor into the cucumbers, but it's totally up to you. And I'm going to add some red onion. I just had this little chunk left in the fridge, so this is definitely going to be enough for this one cucumber. Um, a shallot would be great if you had like you know half a shallot left over, or you know that little bit of onion from that thing you made the other day. This is a great opportunity to use that up. Then we're gonna go and add some black pepper and some salt. Then I'm going in with some apple cider vinegar. This is just the favorite vinegar that we use in my house, but it's really good with red wine vinegar or sherry vinegar. You could even do a rice wine vinegar. You can just do white vinegar, whatever you want. The only one I wouldn't recommend is balsamic because it'll make the cucumbers a really funny color. <laughs> then I'm gonna seal it up if I can get this bowl to seal. Give it a real good shake. Mix up all those ingredients. Make sure everything is coated evenly. And there you have it, quickles. They can last in the fridge for up to two weeks, depending on your uh, crunchy preference, I guess. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe, wash your hands, have fun with it. If you could take a moment to please subscribe to our channel, it really does help us a lot and I really appreciate it. As always, head to mainsnapped.org for more. And while you're there, if you want to sign up to receive text to help you shop, cook, and eat healthy on a budget, check out the link in the description box below. Thanks, bye-bye.